what's going on with y'all boys man so i'm going to make this intro very quick for y'all boys man because i really want to get to this video and break this video down for y'all so if you new make sure you hit that like button right now if you're watching this video right now hit that subscribe button if you still new make sure you hit them notice so y'all can know when i'm uploading right so listen as y'all can see this will be a video on how to actually play defense now this video i'm about to show y'all is me in college four years ago four or five years ago and I played against some of the best people in college. I am an undersized guard. So if you are an undersized guard watching this video, <laughs> you came to the right video. Now, if you still need to learn how to play defense, I got you. So look, starting off this right here, I am pressuring the basketball. So with that being said, this is tip number one. Just pressure the ball. I'm telling you right now. Sometimes you could just read the person with the ball. They might be scared. They might not be scared. But if you are a defender and you like playing defense, all you got to do is pressure the ball. And this is why. He dips it down to the corner. He passes it back up. Boom, I'm back up. Pressure in it. And look, turnover. Turnover for a fast break layup. There y'all go. Sometimes it don't even have to be a steal all the time. And that's tip number one right there for y'all. So, boom, right here. I am pressuring the basketball. I knew these kids did not want the ball in their hand back then. Watching it now, whenever you're looking back at a video and you see things clearly, it's like, wow. <laughs> it's crazy. So, look, I'm pressuring the basketball, right? Boom. He dips it down to the middle, right? Turnover. Because we are pressuring them, and they don't know what to do with the ball, and we got another layup. Real simple, real easy. Now, I'm going to keep pausing from time to time so because I, I really want to break this down for y'all, and I really want y'all to understand. This team I was playing on, I was like the hype man. I was the defender, the point guard, the passer, the shooter, basically me doing everything. As a undersized guard it started with me first so if you are a person that's hyperactive and you like playing defense it starts with you so boom I keep pausing at the wrong times right so boom my boy Ama he's pressuring the ball a little bit he throws a turnover right this is us as a group it starts with me I am high shadow on up at the three-point line so he will not get that pass off right there and this is what happens when they try to force a pass he tried to catch it turnover now we on a fast break once again dip it off dunk we out to the crib let's go all right now here go another one i'm pressuring the ball right i'm dropping back down to my zone right we're playing the matchup zone right i'm in the middle i'm seeing ball i'm seeing man we back over here. I'm pressuring the ball. He don't know what to do. He's swinging it. They swinging it back again. Four shot. And they called a foul. It should not be a foul. But hey, that's what it is. Now, right here. We're going to go back. We're going to go back a little bit. Boom. This is our full court press, right? We send two at you. I'm in the middle. Now, this is where I messed up at. Here's one of the errors that I'm going to show y'all. I'm adding errors in here for a reason, good and bad, so y'all can see from my point of view. Now, this is where I messed up at. I was shading over to the right side because I'm thinking they're going to pass it back over that way when I should have shaded towards the middle because in a full court press, middle is going to be open most of the time. If you get it to the middle, the press is over. So I should have shaded over a little bit, but I made up for it with going for a back tip. He gets the ball, turnover. I'm showing a clip of me scoring right here, I think. <laughs> you know I got to add a clip of me scoring in there. Little chips ahoy right there, things of that nature. Boom, we back into our press, right? Boom, he throws it over, right? The middle is not open. We full court pressing him. They're turning it over because we're pressuring them. And this is what happens right here. Turnover. Once again, Jalil, pass the ball next time, brother. Boom. Once again, I am adding errors in here because I mess up as a point guard. Back then, I forced it. 
I turned the ball over a lot. Looking back at myself now, I wish I was playing college basketball now, but because I know a lot more and I learned and I also learned how to be more patient as a point guard. But here go an example right here. Never give up. If you are a defender that likes to play defense, I turned the ball over because I am only looking one way when I should have passed the ball to my left-hand side with my other teammate. Boom. Turnover, right? Now, I like to play defense. Charge. Real simple, real easy. This is my favorite video right here against this team. I had two matchups I had to do for this game. Number four and number one, I think. Number one was the high leading scorer. I had to face guard both of them the whole entire game. Now, I'm face guarding number four. This is really nothing right here, but I'm just showing y'all as a defender, if you want to play at the high level, this is what you have to do. You have to face guard. Now, here go another video of me right here, face guarding number one. Coach told me don't worry about everybody else. Face guard them, get the job done. That's what I did. Real simple, real easy, right? Once again, I am face guarding number one, right? We are face guarding him. He should not get the ball right here, but I gave him the ball. We got a little back tip for a shot. I did what I had to do. Now, once again, here go tip number two. Tip number two. If you want to get steals, put your hand out, either hand, open up either left side or right side. Do not square your body up because you will get dropped. <coughs> Word. And watch this. Turnover. We out to the crib. Lay. Real simple, real easy. Now we are back in our zone. I'm stutter stepping, closing out, right? I'm stutter stepping, closing out, right? I'm pressuring the ball so they can't get nothing in the inside, right? Now I know coming up, this was my main matchup right here. I did not want him scoring at all. But I know we are in a matchup zone, so if anything happens, if he scores, okay. The whole point of this is you want to drive through the middle, right? So I force a turnover right here. He passes it, right? Swipe. We are out. And one. It's, it's right here for y'all boys, man. I'm, I'm, I'm giving y'all free tips, bro. I'm, I'm telling y'all, defense win games. So we are up nine right now. We are up nine right now. Second half, I think, right? Boom. This play right here. This is when I knew I was a defender. Not going to lie. This is when I knew I was a defender. If you can see this, you have basketball IQ. Just watch this whole play. I could have did two things. I could have grabbed it, threw it off of him, or I could have grabbed it and threw it back for us to get the play. But I was just so into the game, I just ran, dove for the ball, swiped it out of bounds. So they can just steal. So we could get another, so we could get another good possession, I guess. I don't know. Boom. Now this is at my university that I went to, right? I had a bad year here. I don't really want to get into it, but if y'all want more history on my college career. And whatever the case may be, let me know in the comments. But right here, boom. We are playing defense, right? I'm seeing ball. Now, that's both of our fault. Because we let them dive back. We let them dive back down to the middle. Now, once again, whenever I mess up on defense, nine times out of ten, I'm going to make up for it. Boom. So boom, right here, right? He dives in, 
He thinks he got an easy bucket because he don't see me. Most of the times, the way how I get my steals, nine times out of ten, they don't see me. I'm small. I creep everywhere, and I'm going to swipe at the ball. Boom. I'm pressuring the ball. He gets me right there. I'm still over there. I recover. Turnover. Turnover. Right? Once again, tip number three. Back tips. Back tips, back tips, back tips. He knows I'm behind him. But because he don't know what side I'm running on, he stutter steps and he throws the ball back over to his opposite hand. He throws the ball back over to his opposite hand, right? Boom. Guess what, coach? Back tip. He gets the ball back. I don't know how. Turnover. For a fast break layup. Here, I'm going to pause. Boom. So cool. We let him get the ball in. Cool. We let him get the ball in. My big man is right there for recovery. I know this because I'm a defender. Any big man that gets the ball in the middle, soon as they turn and face up towards the basket, they're going to bring the ball down. I'm telling you, they're going to bring the ball down. Boom. So here go another play. They don't know where I'm at, coach. <laughs> this is why I play. <laughs> this is why I play basketball. I love to play defense, coach. <laughs> he passes it. Boom. He can't throw it nowhere. Wherever he throws it to, it most likely is going to be a steal. He could have lobbed it back over there, over the top of my boy Mason Head for an easy bucket. But clearly, he just didn't think of it. Me, knowing me, I see ball, man, 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 ball, right? Boom. Come on, bro. And if you pay the passing lane, you're going to get a steal. I get the bucket. Fast break layup, which it should have been a foul. So this is the video for y'all boys, man. If y'all enjoyed this video, if y'all want part two on anything, defense, how to score as an undersized guard, how to play college basketball, the things you should do to get to the next level. I am a professional basketball player now. I am playing professional basketball, right? So if y'all want more videos like this on anything, comment down below. I appreciate y'all boys, man. I'm out.